Hey team, what's up? Welcome to day six of our Just Move program. We are doing legs, cardio, and core today. I have a set of 10s and 15s. Grab what works for you. That might be 5s, 8s, 20s, um, but we will be working legs, cardio, and core. Let's go ahead and jump right into our warm up and then I will explain our format. We're going to start warming up on the ground. We are going to do our hip series that we've done plenty of times before. In a quadruped position, hands and feet, you are going to be kicking right back, right here. Kicking up to the ceiling. We are going to do 10 here. Get our hips and glutes all nice and warm for this lower body workout with some cardio and core involved. Now we're going to do side kicks here. They're actually fire hydrants. Your hips and glutes will warm up nice and fast. Cannot believe we are almost halfway through our program. I'm so glad that you've been along for the ride with me. Two, one, let's do 10 circles here. So stay on that same side. There we go. I hope you all have been feeling amazing this week and are ready to rock and roll with this day six of our program. Let's switch directions and go backwards. Here we go. Let's give me four more here, and then we'll switch to the other side. Three, two, one. I'm gonna rotate a little bit, and we're doing back kicks here. Let's go for 10. Here we go, I love this move. Makes my core, hips, and glutes ready to make this workout happen. Six. There we go, two more here. All right, give me those fire hydrants right here. Nine, ten, give me forward circles. There we go. Love to check in with you. How have you been feeling the last two weeks? Have you been challenging yourself? Are you feeling good, strong, maybe a little bit sore? Let's go the opposite direction. Make sure that you are hydrating, getting enough water in throughout the day, both before and after your workout. So important to make sure we are getting that proper hydration. There we go, three, two, and one. Awesome job. We are gonna go to our side and we're gonna do side line clamshells. So you can put your um, hand on your head, your feet are gonna stay together, your hips um, and knees are out in front of you just a little bit, and you're gonna open and close right here. We're gonna do 10 total. Know those glutes are really feeling it by now. All right, extend that top leg and give me 10 right here. There we go. Breathing out as you lift. Good, two more and then we will switch sides. Nice job. All right, we got a bonus one there. Other side, line, clamshells. Let's go here, let's go for 10. Eight, nine, ten, good, and extend and up. Let's go five more. And rest. Good. Go ahead and come on up. We're gonna pedal our calves just for a few moments, and then we'll do some toy soldiers as I tell you the format today. Alright, so we have two main circuits with three moves each. We'll go through them three times. All right, walk it back. As I explain the rest, just come with me here. Toy soldiers, all right, that's what I want you to do. Toy soldiers as I get us going. Two main circuits, three moves each, and three rounds each, all right? 30 seconds for each move, brief rest break in between. So the first one, is our basic move, but such a good one, is just a deadlift, all right? So be the first move. Second move will be a squat to press. We'll transition, and then we'll do squat to press for the other side, all right? So make sure your dumbbells are ready. Grab your last sip of water. We've wrapped up that warm up. We're gonna do deadlifts. I am gonna grab the heavier set for myself for the deadlifts, and I'll switch to my tens. So let's get going here. Deadlifts have started, 30 seconds, 
down deep. Very well, make sure your form is nice and tight. Shoulders are back. Squeezing your shoulder blades together. All right, we'll transition. I'm gonna grab my 10 for the press. The second round, I may bump it back up. But let's see what we got here. Two, one, let's go squat to press here. All right, so this one, you can go heavier, maybe you go a little bit slower. Perfectly up to you, maybe you use it more as a strength move, or the way that I'm doing it with a little bit lighter, and I can go a little faster, get my heart rate up faster. So there we go. So as usual, make this workout your own. As usual, just move. That's what we're here doing this month. Good, in this program and rest. Good. 10 seconds, we'll go to the other side. That's what we're doing this month. Just moving, moving our body to, to stay strong. Here we go. So listen here and press. Good. Good. Hips back, squeeze your glutes on the way up. Nice work. About halfway through on this move. Everything is nice and warm at this point. Heart rate is elevating. Muscles are getting warm. Five seconds. Here we go. Good. 15 seconds. Transition. I'm gonna pick up my heavy dumbbells again for a second round out of three. And then we'll get going, all right? So do what works for you, but challenge yourself. Here we go, and begin. Do what works for you, but like I said, challenge yourself. Make sure at the very end of that 30 seconds, you're telling yourself, oh, I needed a quick break. That's gonna tell us that you're lifting heavy enough. More than halfway there, great work. Last five seconds here. Nice and transition. Good. Got the weight. I'm grabbing ten. What are you doing today? Challenge yourself. Here we go. Let's go with me. wrap up round two of these three moves. All right, three, two, let's go. Like I said, really sit back in those hips, push through the heels. Here we go, are you going faster or are you going heavier weights? Choose one of the two to make sure you're making the most out of this quick workout. Last five. Here we go, almost there. Two, one, great job. 15 second transition. I'm doing it with you. We're in this together. Go and grab those weights. Final deadlift here, let's go. You gotta be ready to rock and roll. Not too much rest here. We're working it. We're making changes here, getting stronger with our muscles and our heart. Keeping ourselves healthy. Let's go, last 10. Two, one, and good. All right, let's grab that other weight. If you're switching, squat to press. Choose your side. Two, one, let's go. You're making it happen, I'm so proud of you. Push through that burn, push through the top. 
tough, the hard. It'll be done soon. Hang in there, 10 seconds. Last five seconds. Amazing. All right, other side, then we'll get a longer rest break. Here we go. Five, three, right on. Let's go here. Last 30 on this circuit. I know the third round of circuits can be really tough. We want to switch it up. This is where the true change happens. Time under tension. Last 10. Home stretch. Three, two, one, and good. Great job. All right. I do have a bench here, and I am going to be using it for this next round. You can also use a chair if you have one, or you can just do a static one. So let me tell, show you what we're doing here. Move this out of the way. All right, so we have Bulgarian lunges here. So what that looks like is the back leg is elevated, you're down and up. Do 30 seconds on one side, 30 on the other. Or if you don't have a chair or a bench, just keep it light. Let's go here. So as you're doing this, your chest is gonna fall forward a little bit, a little bit at an angle, but try to keep that weight in that front heel. If you wanna have weights for this, that's all you for this round. I'm gonna build on it for today. And you'll see these again in the program, don't worry. Here we go, great job. Transition to the other side. Again, if you don't have a bench or a chair, just do a static lunge for me. Three, two, let's go here. 30 seconds. Nice work, I know these are tough, especially after the work we just did, but push through it. My legs are already shaking. Last 10 seconds here. Good, three, two, and rest. Good, all right. Next move is gonna be a mountain climber. One, two, three, four, with one push up. All right, so let's go here. You can always do this on the ground or off the, off the bench if you have one or if you're near a kitchen counter, you can do it there. Remember, do what works for you. So it's a four count, one, two, three, four, with a push up. This is our core move. Good. Almost there. And rest. Whew. All right. Come up slowly. <laughs> All right. Second round. Start with where you began last time. Let's go in three, two, get that foot up. Let's go, 30 seconds here. If you wanna push yourself a little bit more, totally fine to grab a weight. You can keep the weights here by your side. You can rack them. Here we go, push through that back leg. That front heel, that's what I meant there. Final stretch, good. We're at three, two, Transition. Doing amazing. All right. Let's wrap it up here together. Let's go. 30 seconds starts now. Feeling it. Quads, glutes, hamstrings. It's all alive and well. Halfway there. Amazing. We'll hit the mountain climbers. 
Four mountain climber count with your push up. Three, two, let's go. Core is nice and tight. Out. And then push it back. Bracing your core. Good. Almost there. Three, two, finish this round. Good. All right. I'm gonna grab some water. Ten seconds. Final round. Come with me. Three, two, let's go. Final round. Show me what you got here. Keep that form nice and tight. This is still working your core, your hip complex. Good. Last 10 seconds. Make it happen. Let's go. Three, two. Final round of this other side. Come with me. We'll get to shake it out a bit. We have four minutes to do these four moves. You'll be doing a deadlift to a high pull. You'll do eight of those. Then you'll do eight single leg squats on one side, do eight on the other, and then you'll do eight dumbbell swings, okay? So follow along. If you get in front of me or behind me, that's fine. Let me get my my timer set up for this. Four minutes, eight reps each. Let's go. The deadlift to the height pull. You're going for eight. Love am wraps because you can go at your own pace, do what works for you. Take a quick breather if you need it, but ideally you're gonna move through this whole four minutes. Grab the weight that works for you. Single leg here. If you can't quite do it without balance, just put that back foot down or grab onto something with you. Amazing. Nice and focused on these single leg squats. We've introduced some balance moves today with the Bulgarian squats and these lunges. Here we go. Kettlebell, dumbbell swing if you're with me. Good, if you just wanna keep the one dumbbell and you don't wanna transition out, you can do your deadlift here. Deadlift to pull, and you can do four on each side, okay? 
So I'm gonna give you a little bit of variety there that you can choose from. If you don't feel like switching each time, good. We're working. I told you it was the legs, cardio, and core. Not disappointing, right? Hang on to your balance. Stay focused. Good work, friend. Amazing. We're training for life right here. We're pushing through the hard, pushing through the tough. Things that are gonna build our endurance. We're gonna be stronger for next time. Amazing work. More than halfway through here. Grab that second dumbbell for this one this time. How are you? How you feeling? You're moving with me, right? Final move, the 
plank jacks with the push up. Let's go in here. Three, two, one, plank, jack, jack, push up. Back up, jack, jack, push up. If you need to, you can always just step it out here. That's totally fine. Halfway there. Final stretch, team. Three, two, can you finish this rep? And rest. And that's where we square it off, team. Made it to your cool down here. Give me a press back into a child's pose. As usual, let's give our body some gratitude for this workout and movement session. Big deep breath, two deep breaths for me. Alright, why don't you come down into a downward dog. We're going to stretch out those calves. Downward dog here. Let's pedal those calves here. Good. My heart rate is slowly going to come down. Great work, routine. Good. Alright, come to your knees. Bring one knee up. And we're going to press into that. I want you to give yourself a little bit of a rotation through the trunk. Good deep breath. Now rotate the other way, but you're going to pull that shoulder in toward you. Good deep breath. Good deep breath. All right, we're going to go the other side with me, opposite side up. Move into that. You know, rotate that opposite arm to the other way, opening up the chest, continuing to bring our heart rate down. You did absolutely amazing. Legs, cardio, and core. Super quick, efficient, safe, fun workouts. All right, so to the other side. I'm so glad that you chose to use your time to work out with me today. I hope you've been loving the Just Move program. It's been amazing for you. I hope you're finding energy at the end of this workout, of these workouts. Alright. So come on up. Roll it up. Good. We're gonna do a quick quad stretch here for me. Worked those quads quite a bit. I uh, hope you love the Bulgarian squats. I've really been enjoying those with my newer bench that I've been able to add to this set. So we'll continue to see the bench with some other moves too coming up on the channel. So Amazing work. I hope you are giving yourself a high five at the end of these workouts. Seriously, go give yourself a high five. I'm so proud of you for accomplishing day six with me. Amazing work. I cannot wait to see you for week three coming up. It's going to be fantastic. Make sure that you share the workout with a friend as usual. Like the video on your way out and subscribe to the channel as well. It helps me so much to continue bringing these workouts to you. All right, we said it to ourselves, I can and I will make an amazing day.